going on guys it's redline garage um today we are in santa cruz didn't vlog much on the way over here because we didn't have any batteries charged or anything but um today we're going to be going to gooding and company gooding and company car show uh, uh auction auction it's an auction yeah it's an auction it's an auction <laughs> um we'll be in santa cruz this whole week for car week uh it's gonna be a really busy and exciting week um we didn't bring we brought the nice the honda as you can see the trusty the trusty steed it's a little out of santi's comfort zone it's a little too much power for the kid <laughs> but you know that's just how it is hey man on the way over here dude but um on the yeah. way over here it was really nice it was it was a long drive no joke 17 hours but I mean, we made it, we're here, and then we're gonna take advantage of the time that we're here. So we made it. We are at the Gooding and Company. Gooding and Company. It's actually really nice. It's not too packed right now. Um, so we're gonna go around, check out some of the cars. It's crazy. You don't know what's gonna pull in, dude. Yeah, it's, it's so crazy. Like just anything. Comes out of yeah. This is Seven. insane. Seven. I'm in New Mexico too. This is crazy. This one's expected. No reserve. There's a video on it and everything. Hey. That's crazy. If y'all want to see more or learn crazy. more about this car, the Admiral's 1955 Ferrari 500 Mondial Special oh. 2. Series 2. It's just this title on YouTube. Let's see. Let's go. This is pretty insane for it being our first day, first couple hours. We have seen $14 million cars and $100,000 cars, but uh, it's been pretty crazy. You guys can take a look here. Renzo's been enjoying the hell out of this for sure. 458 Speciale, BMW 633 CSI. I'm pretty sure this is probably where they got Austin Yellow from. Pretty nice. Z8, old school Porsches. We've got a little bit of everything here. Whatever you guys like, put in the comments. Renzo took some pretty badass photos of everything. He'll be sure to put those in. For Ooh, yeah, like, all I'm gonna try to start tomorrow. Start editing today, each day, and. Um, get that content out for you guys if you don't follow me on ig it's uh ftlc rp um that's where everything's at these videos the photos and everything that's where it goes it's basically the whole portfolio <laughs> you guys are ever in car week or in monterey carmel whatever it is be sure to come to gooding rm and um enjoy all the auctions to be honest even i think Mecum is going to have a few exotics so that's going to be pretty crazy we should go to that but um, let's walk around. Yeah, here. let's go ahead and walk around and continue. Oh my gosh. Show and auction. For all the JDM lovers, we got the 2000 GT. We're from Toyota 1967. Going for. Make sure we don't hold the coffee over the podcast. Oh, yes, sir. Thank you very much. <laughs> nice. Give me, the, give me <laughs> the camera. You drink your coffee. <laughs> We've got a GTC4 Luso 70th anniversary. That's why it's got a livery on it. The inside is pretty mint. It's like this weird tan suede slash Alcantara kind of looking material. All the little red accents are super cool. Inside where you choose your gear, reverse, neutral, matches the pinstripe on the outside. Pretty badass. Got an OG F40. 
Super nice. Paint is perfect. Can't go wrong with an F40. G GT, GT3. We got a GT3 cup and an old 996 GT3 cup. Super sweet. Love the wheels on this car. Lorenzo was saying that he would take the old 996 car only because of the wheels. And I think he's wrong. I take, always, I take the newer you, gen you think, with the older you think gen wheels. Every, you think everybody's wrong if they don't agree with you. No. That's the bad no, thing. No, it's not. No, yeah. no. Yes. These wheels on that car would be insane. Still, I can still appreciate last gen. I'm not always have to, okay, new gen, new gen, new gen, new gen. Like, I'm not saying the old gen's not nice, though. I know, but I'm still saying that I would pick the old gen. <laughs> I honestly still think the SV should have been in orange. No. Yeah, why well, not? If you okay, I'm not saying that all SVs are the same, but if you paid attention to people that spec them, if they do like an orange interior or like orange brakes, they'll do the SV in that color. And yeah, I, I mean like to contrast, that's not a lot of. It's not I know, but wind. I like that contrast better. It just looks, it just looks better. I I don't have a problem with this car. I love this car. No, no, no me neither. If it was but orange, still, it still looks good. I still would do it in orange. But I like. still take an AMG GTR. I feel like this is more of like a looker or stunner than an AMG GTR. AMG GTR is a better car. But, yeah, but I this, feel like this that, looks so this, much yeah, better. This is, yeah, this looks really good, but I love how aggressive the AMG GTR is. Like the front on the AMG GTR. No, but this one's like, all right. The other one's just like, I mean, like I, it's a, I, I it's a mean point. face. I get it's your a point, mean face. But I still feel like this car, like in general, the whole car just looks much more exotic. A lot more in your face. Crazy though, 94 Rust, BTR2, and original. Crazy. Original, yeah, but only now it's... That's a big... That's big money. And I'm pretty sure it's going to go for 900. Uh, hold on, try to focus for you. There you go. 900. What? This just shows you like how... Like, yeah, you see some old cars, but these old cars go for so much, it's insane. Can't forget Joey's favorite. And then we got Joey's, Joey's favorite. Purple Morp Morp right here. <laughs> the GT2 RS. GT3 RS. You know what I mean? Everybody <laughs> makes mistakes. Everybody makes mistakes. I just love the GT2 RS as much, and I tend to get them, just the names. But, yeah, this car is fire, man. Right? And it's so cool here because these, all these cars are for sale so you can just like literally go and just open open doors to like million dollar cars and everything and that's insane carbon got the strap would you would you daily this not an rs maybe a regular maybe a regular gt3 yeah and with the with the comfort seats not the not the, not the I, mean, I would do it just because it's just like i mean you, you can like you can. f it just just do it <laughs> this is gonna be one of my favorite ones besides like a a 993 really yeah like just because like the duck the duck bill and like the resort Carrera livery and everything and the color schemes just come in like a no, baby I, yeah, blue I get or it. green is, maybe when you think of porsche this is what you think yeah of. it's crazy because you guys have one of these back at the warehouse and this is chassis number 15 15 and you have chassis 14 number 14 and his is silver and black 3.7 million 3.7 million hey let's uh just, let's just sell let's it just let's, sell it let's just sell it <laughs> We can have our funding for all the shows for like Definitely. for the next five years. This one though, I'm, this one's really special. To me. This one. This one's really near and dear. My dad's dad, my grandpa, had one of these just like this too. The white with the blue stripes. I actually, Facetime my dad earlier, and he's like, "Dude, that's just like my dad's." I know about that? I thought you were just kind of like a a hoonigan in Ken Block no, Mustang fanboy, it but it's good to it's family. good to know that it runs in the family where 
you have a real love and meaning for it and why you like it, you know? But all these cars are in such great condition, it's insane. I've never seen in person, and I finally got to see it today, the first day too. It's a Porsche 918 Spider. And the last time we came here for motocross and everything, went to Rodeo, we sadly didn't get to see one. We saw just about everything else but a 918 Spider. And this spec is really nice. The spec is really similar to yours yeah. when you were telling me earlier too. So we got like the full carbon. This is chassis number 595. 596. 596. Yeah, it's on here too. It's the back. Spec. It was better I don't than like this that. spec. Yeah. This spec isn't that nice. It's, it's got black the carbon. On it's, I mean, it's got the carbon. The carbon. No, you could get the. the you can opt it like to, uh, to. I mean, you paint it, but if you don't paint the roof, they all come in carbon. Hmm. So what would you do? I would like do the an all, all red. The all red I would do all red red with, with black wheels. With no carbon and fiber? With red interior and everything else carbon fiber. So Dang, this everything else. No, red? so this one in carbon, this carbon, and then all the inside. Pop the door. Yeah, I see you open up. Open it up. See I can never get over that. Like the the way the door opens is Crazy, it's, it's, right? it's, it's insane. Crazy. That's the thing that this, okay, this has an advantage over, but I mean, they didn't really detail it so much, but limited edition one of 499. Well, that's a, that's an ordeal with Ferrari right now. They didn't really make 499. They made, they made at least 600 of these. Okay, but this is still number one, though. Like, it's number four? One. No, they all say number one of. Oh, it's one of four. You're just playing with my yeah. feelings then. <laughs> How do you close the door? You can close it. Where do you grab from? From the top. From right here. Where you, yeah, right here. Where the door handle is. No. <laughs> put your hand on top and just close it. Nice. Yeah, see, I'm just not so comfortable <laughs> closing a door to a million dollar car, you see. <laughs> We're thinking of wrapping the ZL1 for the channel. Out of all the colors that you guys see here, or any color that you guys have in mind, put it in the comments and we'll wrap the Camaro that color. Let's well, do it. I would say let's... No, I mean something nice and crazy. But something nice, something not, like something kind of... This fool's, this no. fool's all about like crazy colors and he really wants to stand out and like, hey cops, look at me. It's but, already bright red, like <laughs> exactly. cops already look at it. Exactly, you chose the brightest color out of them all. But um... No, but seriously, we're thinking about we're we're really trying to get this going and everything, and we're gonna eventually wrap the one LE. And I was saying, do this color, or do a chrome, uh, a smoked chrome wrap, which would be which badass. Would be badass. That would be really badass. Or a, but or, if you guys or, or a chromed out version of this color, or, or a smoked out. Let's just let's just think of a cool color. Yeah, so I mean, just let us know in the comments of what color color suggestions that we could wrap it. And um, oil change on the Bugatti. Oil change yeah. is twenty grand. Twenty plus grand. your tires. Plus tires. So if you're doing like a full service on your Bugatti, from what I've heard, is about thirty to forty grand. I mean, who can't afford that, right? Like, <laughs> I, mean, well, I know you are. I'm but really feeling I'm for this push. Six hundred grand. Yeah. Air cooled king, bro. Air that is an air cooled king. Yeah. That's crazy. This thing is insane. Legit BBS's old school. 
I'm really feeling this, dude. I don't know why. Would you date me this? Hell yeah. Look at this. I would. I, I like I the red accents and everything. It really pops. I was telling Lorenzo on the way over here, we're talking in the car, that I don't really like tan interiors unless the car pulls it off. Which I think he's crazy and, for. And this pulls it off really nice. And I really, I'm feeling this, man. Imagine going to school in this and daily driving this. You got enough room why in the back to, 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 wait, to wait, fit wait, two wait, people. Because it would be the daily. If you owned a Ferrari, why would you go to school? My dad's forced me uh, to go to school. No. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. That might be it for today, but who knows? But we'll see. We'll try we'll to catch see. fuel yeah, run. Yeah, we'll try to catch fuel, fuel run. And other than that, so thank you guys for watching and staying with, staying with us on the journey to Santa Cruz. And we got three more or four more days ahead of us of more cars and more fuel and octane and all this stuff. So thanks. See you guys next time. Thank you.